Hello friends, this is Kamal Singh Chauhan and today we will discuss the topic of mental ability named seating arrangement. Now what is seating arrangement? To arrange different person or different items in a queue or around a circular or a square table. So in these type of questions, some clues regarding seating or placing sequence, um, either they are linear or circular or rectangle or some person or item is given. The candidate is required to form the proper sequence using these clues and answer the given questions accordingly. Let's start with the uh, first type. Type first, linear seating arrangement. So type first, linear seating Arrangement. In the uh, in this type, we have to arrange different people in a row. And uh, before starting the question, uh, we should discuss some guideline. For example, suppose we have to arrange different people in this row, then the person which is first in that row is also known as the leftmost person. So this end is always treated as a left end, as well as the person which is uh, uh, the last person in that row is known as the rightmost person in the same row. So whenever we have to arrange different people in a row, take the first person as the leftmost person and the last person as the rightmost person. Suppose uh, A, B, C, D and E are five people. They are uh, sitting in a row then uh, according to the given figure. So A is the leftmost person in that figure and E is the rightmost person in that figure and C is the person having equidistance from both the ends and uh, if we compare the position of C with regarding B then C is next left to the B as well as C is also next right to the uh, C is next right to the B and C is also next left to the D so if we are moving towards A it means we, uh, we are moving towards left side and if, if we are moving towards E it means that we are moving towards right side so we should follow this uh, logic only it doesn't matter that uh, whatever the direction is given direction of the person may be uh, facing toward north or facing toward east or facing toward west or south it doesn't matter but in this ideal condition uh, we should know that all the person who are uh, sitting in uh, according to this arrangement always facing toward upward or northward so this is the ideal condition when all the people are facing towards north. So by using this uh, we can easily arrange the persons according to the given directions. Let's start with some example. Uh, the first example is uh, some statements are given. For example, Q is to the immediate right of T. The next statement is S is exactly between P and T. And the last uh, statement is Q is exactly between T and R. So three statements are given, and uh, five persons are there: P, Q, R, S, and T. And we have to arrange these persons according to the given statements. I am repeating the statements. The first statement is: Q is to the immediate right of T. S is exactly between P and T, and Q is exactly between T and R. So if we arrange the uh, these five persons according to the statement. Then our diagram should be like this. Q is to the immediate right of T. So Q is immediate right of T. Now because Q is right to T, so T should be left to Q. S is exactly between P and T. Exactly between P and T, it means P should be uh, towards left to T. And S is a person who is sitting between T and P. Now the next statement is Q is exactly between T and R. Q is exactly between T and R. That's why we can say that R is the person who is to the right of Q. And according to this statement, the right sequence is P is at the left end, R is at the rightmost end, and T is exactly between both the ends. S is between P and T and Q is between T and R. So the right sequence is P, S, T, Q, R from left to right. 
and uh, suppose uh, whatever the question is asked for example who is uh, exactly middle while standing in a line and T is the person who is exactly in the middle of the row. Uh, similarly uh, take some more example for example five person are standing in a queue one of the two person at the extreme end is a professor it's a, it's a, a tough question based on uh, sitting element so one of the two person at the extreme end is a professor and the other is a businessman an advocate is standing to the right of student a author is to the immediate left of the businessman and the last statement is the student is between the professor and the advocate so let's start the uh, draw the figure i am repeating the uh, all the statements the first statement is five person are standing in a queue it's mean five person are there uh, this is our second example uh, five person are there in that queue so one two three four five just mark five places now one of the two person at the extreme end is a professor now either the, this person is professor or this person is professor and the other is businessman if this is professor then this person should be businessman and if the, uh, business, uh, if this is a uh, professor then the person who is at the right end should be businessman so options are there now an advocate is standing to the right of the student okay one more data is given and that is advocate is standing so that advocate is denoted by a then he is standing to the right of student is standing to the right of a student then a student should be to the left of advocate so let a uh, student denoted by s then s is to the left of a or a is to the right of s next is author is to the immediate left of businessman now if, uh, because uh, we are taking businessman at uh, one of the extreme end and according to this statement businessman author is to the immediate left of businessman so uh, now this is clear that businessman should be the rightmost person then only this possible that author will be um, uh, to the left of businessman because uh, if businessman to the left end then it is not possible that any person uh, sitting or standing uh, to the left of businessman so if we take businessman to the right end then only the person who is author au is to uh, is immediately left to the businessman a uh, student is between professor and advocate okay this is given that student is between professor and advocate so uh, one more thing which is clear that professor is uh, to the immediate left and because student between professor and advocate so this is the right sequence that professor is at leftmost end businessman is at rightmost end uh, student is next right to the professor then advocate is between student and author and also advocate is next right to the student author is next right to the author author is next right to the advocate and finally uh, the businessman is the rightmost person so we can easily solve the uh, given puzzles uh, by following this, uh, this, uh, this these rules uh, we should take the person the first person as a leftmost person and the right uh, the last person as a rightmost person Okay, now ne take uh, another type of this seating arrangement which is a circular seating arrangement. So type second. 